Hello from Gardening at Duenza and I'm not in Ireland at the moment I'm in Brittany in northern France where I've come along to have a look at a fantastic 12th century Roman Abbey can you believe it but that's not what this video is about if you're interested I'll put a couple of shots of the Abbey at the very end of the video what I'm here to show you is the monk's garden or the reconstruction of the monk's garden because I think monks were perhaps the first people in France to to make gardens as we know them today and e these gardens had uses they were for growing food and for growing herbs to use in medicine so come on let's have a quick look around the garden take a look around this garden and I think you'll find many things in it that we use even today in gardens. The box balls, the parterres and water. It's such an important feature in any anywhere where it's really hot I guess. All of these plants in the monk's gardens would have had a use whether edible or medicinal or herbs used in medicine, which was the way it was usually done. For example, potentilla here is used to strengthen the uterus and calm it and um, used for other female ailments. We have lots of different types of Artemisia or wormwood and um, they have particularly pungent smells. I like that one over there. Looks really like one I have in my garden. As you can see, box hedging was used in um, this kind of way that we still use it today as a kind of edging to borders. Known as a parterre, this box hedging served to kind of keep the plants in order and um, divide them up so that the monks could easily find what they needed when they needed it. This mature tree here is a meddler and let's have a look at the fruits. A bit like an apple but with this very ugly portion underneath and um, well meddlers are perfectly edible. I've tried to grow this one from seed several times but never been successful. This here is Milano Salinum Decipiens which I believe is native to Madeira can't think that the monks actually grew it and echiums beyond which I'm sure they did I don't know why though Okay, that's the end of the video. Thanks very much for coming along with me and I hope you enjoyed it and maybe found it a bit interesting, especially those who are into kind of uh, edible gardening. Okay, thanks very much. Bye now.